Buenos dias. My name is Kathleen and I live in Playa Hermosa, Costa Rica. So I usually go to school around 6 45, 7 o'clock in the morning, but today I have a doctor's appointment. So I thought it'd be a good opportunity to show you guys a glimpse into the medical system here in Costa Rica. So I'm going to hop on a bus, go into town, and I will check in when I get to the clinic. Before I head out, I wanted to give you a little look at my backyard, which is one of my favorite spots. It's beautiful, surrounded by nature. It's where I spend a lot of my mornings. While I wait, I thought I'd answer a couple of the questions that I've already gotten. As far as how long I've been in Costa Rica, I moved here this time around about one year ago, exactly. So the school year here starts in January and I moved about a month prior, last December. So yeah, we're wrapping up the school year right now. And then we have about a month break before the next year begins. So while we wait, um, one of the really beautiful things about living and working in Costa Rica is that all residents and or workers receive health insurance. It's comforting living abroad and having insurance. I think um, not having to worry about traveler's insurance and knowing that you're covered in case something does happen. And the quality of care is, is great. It's just what you would expect in the States. One thing I will say is that there are very long waits for everything in Costa Rica. Um, it's Tico time is what they call it. And it's not an insult me saying that, it's kind of a self-proclaimed um, Costa Rican thing. So if you have an appointment, I would clear probably three hours out of your day, um, just because it may take a while. And especially through the social security clinics, that's where everybody in Costa Rica goes. This is Jaco. This is the closest city to Hermosa. It's about 10 minutes away. And this is where you'll find all of your doctors, grocery stores, shops, everything like that. While we wait for the bus back to Hermosa to go to school, I got a little snack. <laughs> this is called a grenadilla, and it's one of my favorite fruits um, in Costa Rica. It's a little off-putting when you see the inside. So it's hard on the outside, and then when you crack it open, it has all these slimy little seeds on the inside, and that's what you eat. So. As far as work goes, I love my job. I work at a small bilingual private school in Hermosa, teaching fourth through sixth grade English, math, and science. I came to Costa Rica without securing my job first. It seems like um, they prefer to do in-person interviews here. Um, but once I did arrive, I had my job within two weeks. So on a normal day, I get to school around 7 o'clock, classes begin at 7.30 and end at 2.30. In addition to the classes I teach, English, Science, and Math, the students also have Spanish and Social Studies, which are taught by a Costa Rican professor. Um, however, I do get paid for being there the whole day.
This is the little path from my house to the beach. And I think it's going to be a pretty good sunset. Some coconuts. It's going to be a good sunset. It's high tide right now. Not the most ideal conditions for surfing or swimming. But still beautiful. Getting coconuts.